This isn't science fiction. It's happening in real labs right now. When a species dies, its DNA begins breaking down immediately. But under the right conditions, freezing temperatures, dry caves, or permafrost, fragments of genetic code can survive for tens of thousands of years. And those fragments are powerful. One of the best examples is the woolly mammoth. Scientists have recovered mammoth DNA from frozen Siberian remains, so well preserved that we can compare it directly to modern elephant DNA. What's shocking is that researchers have already identified the specific genes responsible for mammoth traits like thick insulating hair, fat storage, cold adapted blood, and even their distinctive curved tusks. But here's the twist. We can't clone a mammoth. The DNA is too damaged and incomplete. Instead, scientists use a method called genome editing. They take living elephant cells and carefully insert mammoth genetic sequences, essentially recreating mammoth features inside a modern species. This doesn't bring the mammoth back, but it creates a living organism that expresses ancient traits. It's more like building a cold adapted elephant than resurrecting a true mammoth. The same methods are being explored for extinct species like the Tasmanian tiger, the dodo, and even giant Ice Age bison. What ancient DNA is teaching us isn't just how animals died, but how some of them might one day return, at least in part.